Hi, I'm Sean from Roland. Our new range of HP and LX pianos are the first digital pianos on the market to be equipped with Bluetooth technology, which enables you to wirelessly connect your mobile device, whether it's a phone or a tablet, to the piano. And this means you can take advantage of many of the applications that are available for iOS and for Android. There's three ways that you can connect. You can connect via Bluetooth audio, which enables you to stream audio from your mobile device to your piano. You can connect via Bluetooth MIDI, which enables your piano to become a wireless MIDI controller if you want to record into a door. And the third way is via Bluetooth page turn. And this enables you to quite literally turn the page on a score that is displayed in one of the many apps that are available. So let's take a look at how we can connect via Bluetooth audio. The Bluetooth settings are in the function menu, which we access by pressing both the ambience and the brilliance buttons simultaneously. Using the right button, scroll across until you see Bluetooth audio in the display and then press the enter button. You will see the Bluetooth pairing screen, at which point you press the enter button again to start the pairing process. Now you can see in the display that it's saying now pairing because it's waiting now for a response from your mobile device. So let's now go to the mobile device, which in this case is my iPad. And if you go to the settings page on your iPad and turn on the Bluetooth functionality. Now for this demonstration, I'm using an LX7, but it's the same procedure for the HP605 LX7 and LX17. So you can see in the display that the LX7 audio has been detected. And if we tap that, and you can see that it's been paired and Bluetooth audio is highlighted in the display. To adjust the volume of any audio that you are streaming to the piano, you would normally use the volume control on your mobile device. However, if you want more adjustment, if you press the right arrow button again, you can see there is a Bluetooth volume menu, which you can increase or you can decrease the volume as required. To exit the function menu, we press the ambience and the brilliance buttons simultaneously, and we're back to the normal menu. Bluetooth audio can be used for many things. You can stream songs from your iPhone, and uh, you can use the piano as a very nice hi-fi, or you could use an online tutorial, such as a piano tutorial on YouTube, and instead of listening to the audio of that tutorial through the iPad speakers, you can listen to the audio through the piano speakers. So that's Bluetooth audio. So now we're going to look at how we set up Bluetooth MIDI. So let's go back into the function menu and using the right arrow button, we are going to scroll across until we see Bluetooth turn stroke MIDI in the screen and then we're going to press the enter button. Now at this point we can use the plus or minus buttons to select whether we want Bluetooth page turn, Bluetooth MIDI or Bluetooth page turn and MIDI together. But for now we're going to select MIDI. So the application I'm going to use for uh, Bluetooth MIDI is our own Piano Designer app. And the Piano Designer app is the app that enables you to customize the piano sound. So I'm now in the Piano Designer app and within the settings page, if I go to Bluetooth MIDI devices and scroll along until I can see here the LX7. So I'm going to press that. And you can see now that it says it's connected. 
and in the box above select LX7 and on the display of the piano you can see the MIDI icon has appeared. And just to show you that this is actually working now if I play the piano you can see on the screen that uh, the piano designer is picking up from the piano uh, the notes that I'm transmitting to the piano designer. If I go into the design page and adjust the lid, you can hear straight away that we've closed the lid in the designer and the sounds become more mellow. So that demonstrates that we're communicating with the two devices via Bluetooth MIDI. So the final connection we're going to look at is Bluetooth page turn. So let's go into the function menu by pressing ambience and brilliance buttons simultaneously. So in this case, we're going to uh, select page turn. So let's go into the settings on uh, the mobile device, turn on Bluetooth functionality. We tap on the LX7 and now you can see that the LX7 is connected. And also on the screen of the piano, you can see that the logo, Bluetooth page tone logo, has come up. So, let's exit out of the function menu by pressing Ambience and Brilliance. We can use a number of apps that display the score that you can turn pages with. Um, I'm going to use Peer Score, which is this one here. And by pressing the center pedal of the piano, you can see that I'm able to turn the page. So that's Bluetooth page turn. You'll have noticed that within the menu, you can choose between page turn, which we've talked about, MIDI, which we've talked about, and also page turn and MIDI. And you would use this menu, page turn and MIDI, if you wanted to receive MIDI information from an app and also at the same time want the facility to turn the page. And the setup for this is exactly the same setup as if you were setting up for MIDI only. So that's a demonstration of the Bluetooth technology on the new range of HP and LX pianos. I'm Sean from Roland. Thank you for watching.